creative spirits. So today's video is actually going to be a three-part painting series that I did for a show here in Orlando at Rita Fine Arts and these were all up for sale. Night Drive already sold but the other two are currently still available so feel free to email me which the link is in the description if you are interested in acquiring any of these pieces. So these are all inspired by my newfound interest for working with neon colors in a different color palette and a different atmosphere than I am used to using. What initially drove my interest into creating these pieces was actually a sketch that I did that was kind of like a Tokyo night vision type kind of thing and I really wanted to incorporate this vibe and create a, kind of like a little mini series out of it. So So the very first one that I'm working on here is called Night Drive and this one is kind of based on the Panamanian lore that I grew up with when you drive in a dark road and you kind of have this spirit that can attach to your car and come home with you and I thought that was really creepy and eerie and it kind of played on the interest of kind of capturing this nighttime foggy neon type of type of idea that I had. Now the second piece that I decided to paint is called Hanya and this is based on the Japanese folklore and it's supposed to be the big red-headed creature is supposed to be a jealous obsessive creature and in this painting I actually painted that um, as a reflection of how I kind of felt you know everybody kind of sometimes gets pangs of jealousy especially when we see all of the skills that someone else may have or all of the opportunities that they may have that we might not have and I kind of wanted to reflect this but um, also come to terms with it and realize that it is natural and it is normal so that's why I made um, at the very end you'll see a little tiny person with strings trying, kind of trying to control the Hanya and that was the inspiration by, behind this piece.
finally, the last piece is called Kunyochi. I apologize in advance, I'm pretty sure that I am mispronouncing a lot of these words. Um, so please bear with me on that. But this one is about, this one is more about atmosphere than anything else and also kind of like this female warrior and kind of also playing with the industrial feel of the earlier piece that I did with the sprinter trueno kind of like having to do with mechanical things I wanted to do something that incorporated did like guns and weapons and this was an idea that I had a long time ago stored away in my sketchbook and I thought what better way than to use it now for this piece now the really fun thing about working on these small 4x4 pieces on wood panels is that you can kind of experiment with new things that you don't really want to put too much commitment of time and energy into but still experiment and see if it works for you so because I was really invested or interested in trying out neon colors and these bright colors that I'm not used to using in my usually monochromatic or very limited palettes so this was definitely a lot of fun and I learned a lot from this and I'm definitely going to incorporate more color in the future If you guys like it too, please feel free to let me know in the comments. And also if you have any other questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comments as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and I will see you guys next time.